So yeah, I'm back now. <laughs> As you can see. Did you ever watch that movie Inside Out? Oh man, that was good. Um, I, I did a little, did a little tiny amount of research on it and how they got the five basic emotions. Like disgust, I, disgust, disgust. How is that? They they explained how ben, how it is beneficial. Like it keeps you away from poison or or like nasty stuff or or people. I don't know. Is that part of our judgment? Is it disgust? It's like, ew, that person is disgusting. Stay away from them. That can make you lose a friend too. What if that stinky pee over there, the guy in the red sweatshirt, is a really nice guy? He just smells like shit. <laughs> I gotta take a shower today. I'm disgusted. Oh, it makes people take showers. That's what disgust, disgust does. <laughs> so you can smell yourself. You're like, oh my god, I'm disgusted. And fear, but I don't fear if people smell me though. I'm more. I'm just. I just notice it when I notice it. You know, I, didn't, I haven't worn deodorant in a few days, so I forget about it. I just don't think about taking showers. You know? I have no one to impress, really. Except when I go out and I start smelling myself, I'm like, oh, damn. You know, I offend myself. <laughs> I offend myself with the smell. That's what, that's what I'm really worried about offending is myself, I guess. Myself. Do I care about myself too much? Well, I mean, I don't know, because I do care about other people. You know, I worry about. I post a lot of stuff on Facebook, and I, and I worry about other people's and other other people in other countries. You know, um, but what's what can I do? You know, like this this people complaining about, you know, people posting photos of the French flag and saying that's not enough support. Like, what the fuck are we supposed to do? Like go over there and like kill ISIS like single-handedly like just take out ISIS take everybody out but, like I'm going over there Rambo it's my calling ah. or join the military like I mean fuck that I did that already I did that shit I already did that you know and I got pulled into the same shit I was like I want to do something bigger I want to join something that's bigger than myself you know make an, have an accomplishment in my life uh, have, a, have employment um, you know, I thought of all that stuff, and I got, I got sucked into the military thing too. You know, it didn't really work out for me. So, you know, it just it's how it is. You know, and I just you know, but I mean, in terms of helping people, I mean, the least you can do is show support by changing your picture to. French flag. I mean, it's something. Facebook cares enough, you know. <laughs> but what else can you do? I mean, send money to who? Who are you gonna send the money to? To the victims? Well, how much are you gonna send them? Five bucks? I mean, it all adds up eventually. But you might get scammed. What if you get scammed? Sending money overseas? You know? Then then who does it go to? It goes to ISIS. <laughs> ISIS. <laughs> I, that would be a smart thing to do. Like ISIS fucking sets up some like don donation thing for the victims of um, the victims of uh, the attack, and you're, you're supporting ISIS, kind of like what America does with uh, selling weapons to to Qatar and and selling weapons to you know terrorist organizations. It's like what the fuck. It's like, you want to keep the war going? It's like, clearly they do. So they sell them the weapons, and, and like, ISIS, I think ISIS has, most of the weapons consist of United States military equipment, you know? They have, like, Humvees and 50 cal fucking whatever they are, 50 cal guns and and all that shit. And they have AK, they, I think they have AK-47s, I think. So maybe Russia's helping them too. <laughs> Russia's fucking helping them, ISIS too. It's like we're gonna fight against you, but we're gonna give you, we're gonna give you, you know, we're gonna give you weapons. So we're gonna sell you weapons, so we can continue the war because it is profitable. But hey, if, I mean, if it is World War Three, then maybe, maybe it'll all work out for everybody. You know, like I talked about earlier in one of my statuses, it just works out. You know, 
the economy is booming and people are dying, you know, people, military is, you know, employed, Pe people are being employed into the military and enlisted and everybody has a job, you know, we just become a, mil a militaristic nation and, and be scared all the time. I mean, as long as we can have, you know, free education, free healthcare, so the people that don't want to be in the military can do something else, you know, have more options, you know. Not everybody wants to join the fucking military. You know? It's like, that's the only choice we have. <laughs> and that's a lot of poor people have, that's the only choice they have. And that's kind of how it is now. You know, in wartime, you know, people, poor people are the, you know, like, run the military. Or not, yeah, you know, like, not run it, but, you know, enlist in the military. Um, because they, you know, they can't afford school. They can't afford, you know healthcare so they're like fuck it I'm joining the military I get an education I can get school and I as a 50 50 chance I'll, I might die or maybe a 60 40 but you know I guess I'll take my chance take my chances instead of having another opportunity you know more options to succeed in this country in this First world country. It's a first world, right? I don't know. But you get what I'm saying. It's just it's sad. I just, yeah, you know, it's land of the free, but not the land of many opportunities or options right now. You know, I mean, Obama tried to make it that, but he's he's kind of like. You know, he's trying to compromise with the Republicans, with the, we're still going to pay for health care. It's going to be affordable health care. And they don't like it. <laughs> you know, the Republicans don't like it. And Bernie Sanders is just saying, fuck it. We're going to, you know, we're going to give it for free. Or government subsidized health care and education. I'm fucking shaking right now. It's fucking cold. <sighs> oh, shit. It's like 40 degrees out. Anyway. Good news <laughs> on, a, on another on, on good on a good note. My friend Jeff Ribeiro is moving back. Is not moving. Oh my God! Whoops! <laughs> not moving. He's visiting uh, Boston for a few week for a, a week and a half, I think. So we're gonna be hanging around, doing stuff, chilling, going to open mics. Should be a fun time. And that's all I want to tell you. Whatever's on my mind, it just comes out <coughs> in the... Oh, damn, I messed up. See, it all comes out at the drop of a dime within a brand new rhyme. Line after line, design my own mind. I already said mind, but I guess I can say mind again. Now I'm just going off topic and going crazy, but I'm just trying to kill the time here. I have two minutes left till the video is up. See how long I can talk for. <laughs> what topics? I kind of cut myself off at the Bernie Sanders thing, but you know, there's only so much you can say that say about that. I can talk about minimum wage all day, and then you see, like you know, I said all these good points about minimum wage. I mean, uh, the minimum wage being raised, and then you know, some fucking idiot comes along and it's like, duh, the minimum wage shouldn't be raised, and I was, that's when they get deleted. I'm like, bam, fucking dumbass motherfucker. It just pisses me off. Like people still think like that that the minimum wage shouldn't be raised to a living wage. Like fucking people, you know, people are retarded. Sorry, but I don't like to use that term, but you know, you get what I'm saying when I use that term. It's ridiculous. I saw that today. Some, some girl was like, oh, they should firefighters should be getting paid. Like, when does, do, fire, do firefighters get paid $11 an hour? I don't think they do. I think that's a crock of shit. Cause they're like, oh, fifteen dollars to fuck up my order. It's like, shut the hell up. It's like, what the fuck? But you rather have them starving and on welfare instead of getting, making a living wage? That doesn't make sense. I don't understand that that logic. It's like, collect welfare, have three jobs, die young. <laughs> it's okay. Have no, don't have any health care. 
don't have time to go to school because you're working, you know, 90 hours a week and you're fucking on welfare. And then people are like, oh, don't get, that's an excuse. It's like, all right, fucking, you know, not everybody can do that. Not, that's, that's ridiculous. 80 hours a week and, and, and trying to go to school at the same time. You know, then you don't have time for other things. Every, you need you need leisure time. I don't care what you say. People need leisure time. It's it's a natural human thing. If you study psychology, you know people need leisure time. It's just human nature. All right, I'll be back.